Hello and welcome once again to my stuff YouTube. This is Luther Fast and before today I'm gonna to talk about Pokemon. Why? Because we all know that the X and Y series for that anime and the game is pretty much already over. So they made a remake of um Ruby and Sapphire, which is now Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. So, <clears throat> no, I am only talking about things. No, note that I am only talking about what they already did, but I am going to be talking about what they're probably going to do. Well, there's a possible chance that they are going to be making a Generation 7 Pokemon game and an anime. So, I'm just going to take, I'm just going to use what I've heard from multiple YouTubers, from multiple different, from different multiple videos I've seen on YouTube, and use what I've heard and possibly you know, probably give uh, ideas to Nintendo, hopefully. So, instead of trying to think about um, new Pokemon, think about other animals that hasn't been um, Pokemon on. Pokemon that you have not made into Pokemon yet. In other words, um, if Nintendo were to possibly, like the creators of Pokemon, were to go on YouTube and search up, um, whoever it was I was watching, what's his name? True Greens, Evan, and who else? Nope. Mad JTV Pokevids. They were making videos of, well, these two videos I was watching, I were, I was just watching a few seconds ago. It's 10, top 10 animals that need Pokemon versions. Now, if it's possible, Nintendo, look these look these people up. And look for top ten and top five. Cause as I was watching, I, I noticed they were talking about um how all the fossil Pokemon are mammals. When the only Pokemon that is a mammal that should have been a, um, a fossil if, uh, is um, mammoth swine which is actually the evolution of swine up which I don't know <laughs> it started up at, it started as swine up then pile, sw pile of swine and now we have a mammoth what? Wait, wait, no. Think about this. We have... I forgot the name. Swine Up and Pile of Swine. Swine Up. Pile of Swine. They're swines. Pigs. And then... The last evolution is supposed to be... A hairy elephant. How does that work? <laughs> Please explain this to me. How is it that a little tiny ball of hair, which is supposed to be related to a pig, and then have its last evolution be a mammoth? Mammo swine? Mammo swine. Is it supposed to be a hybrid of an elephant? A hairy elephant, the mammoth. 
it even it eat it's it even has a pig nose. It, it does. Why? <laughs> and the whole deal with Ash being ten. Okay. So I heard from I don't know which YouTuber, but apparently they had the idea of jumping Ash's age from 10 to 14. I was thinking maybe if they don't do that in the X and Y series, they can just wait until the sixth generation is over. Sorry, I had an itch. <laughs> Like, I don't know. They had Serena go through, I don't know what it was, but she had to shape it up. So in, in order to um, go along with her dream, being a Pokemon, whatever, um, she had her little moment. It was almost like a Titanic almost, but it was more dramatic. She runs off over to the, the ocean. She has scissors. She brings her hair back and she cuts it. And she has lo her long hair is now short. <laughs> so what, what I'm thinking is, sure, the manga and the, the anime show cartoon is totally different but at least put Ash into a situation that he thinks to himself I, I need to grow up at least do that at the end of the Unova? No I, yeah the Unova League at the end of the Unova League or during the Unova League, he has uh, a battle, and I don't know what it, what's going on, but he needs to go through this situation, and at the end of it, the person he was fighting against, or just, I don't know, battling, poke battling, uh, at the end of it, the trainer talked with Ash and asked him how is it you got this far think about it lose use what you learn and I don't know <laughs> possibly prosper not prosper um I don't know. <laughs> well, at least it has to be something epic. Or something deep. Put him through a deep little something. And then at the next generation, the next episode, not episode, uh, series, generation series, it's going to be the seventh generation new, not X and Y anymore. But hopefully. Hopefully. Since we already have all these mega evolutions, the next generation has to have nothing to do with uh, mega evolutions. Nothing. Sure, the mega evolutions were cool, but it was only a one-time thing. But if they were going to do something with the mega evolutions in the seventh generation, they at least have to do it with the Johto starters. Like, if they're going to do something, at least have... um. A, a, an eighth generation so whatever you think about that um go on the idea wiki because i saw some that seemed really cool apparently well I, I think i already have a video of it or i deleted the video because it was from the idea wiki and to me i thought it was really cool it had new types it, there was Neo and what was the other one? 
Neil and but the Neil was supposed to be uh, fairy tale creatures, not fairy tale creatures, but more likely um, the paranormal almost. Like let's just not like ghosts, but gnomes, werewolves, and whatever witches. And then the, the other one was a little bit futuristic because it has <clears throat> robots, cyborgs. Like, sure, it, it almost, it made me think, it's the same thing as having a Steel-type Pokemon, but no. Because, I don't know. <laughs> like, let's have a little separation of human and Pokehuman. Because, remember in the Shino, was it Shino? I think it was. Which one had Team Galactic? If you already know, um, let me finish. Well, <laughs> you can't talk to me at the moment, but if you were to scream at the computer, be like, uh, I'll, I'll just be keep going on with what I was doing, you know. But whatever, I'm gonna go on with the what I was talking about. There is um right near the fifth gym leader which was a steel gym leader there was uh, a library and you could read all these books and it told you all about the Pokemon lures and there were there was a book two books one about people actually eating Pokemon and people marrying human humans marrying the Pokemon like the humanoid Pokemon you know like Machop um, Gardevoir I don't see anyone getting with a Pikachu anytime soon <laughs> that would be kind of creepy size difference how does this work okay well like I was saying the lures this that have a little off the edge kind of thing for the eighth generation if it ever happens. Neo and robotic, I guess. <laughs> like as I said before, it's on the idea wiki that I saw. I can't remember exactly what it was. I remember there was Neo and something else. But at least instead of trying to make something up and if because I know how some Pokemon are made well I don't because I wasn't there when it happened they have to think they have to get ideas they have to uh, make it first and then if they don't like it they just crumble it up and throw it away don't try to make it on your own there's a whole bunch of Pokemon lovers whole bunch of people out here not out here specifically but there are a po whole bunch of people around the world that still love Pokemon for the simple charm of it being their favorite show and instead of trying to make your own idea go on the idea wiki I'm not talking about um, the people who are actually watching the video as in regular everyday people who like and watch the anime or play the games I'm talking about like if this ever happens, if the people who make Pokemon ever go on YouTube and watch videos, they should at least check this video out. <laughs> oh, even the the hacked games on the <laughs> the dog outside scared me. Even the hacked Pokemon games on the computer like um, there's Pokemon, where is it, Septo Conquest, Pokemon Vega, Pokemon Vega is a, a Japanese game, like it's all Japanese, no English at all, but it's actually, it has a really cool uh, concept to it, there's different Pokemon, there's a water Pokemon that looks like a glob, but it's really awesome, I think, 
Yeah, it's it's last evolution almost looks like a a muck, but whatever. It's still awesome. <laughs> Sorry, I've been gassy all day, but whatever. This has been Luther Five Seventy Four, and yeah.